Okay guys, so my little water cooling unit here that I've built, uh, it has a small problem. I end up dripping a couple drops of water on the board so I gotta try and dry it off. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and show you how I dry off a motherboard. Hey okay, guys, so I got the motherboard out. Alright, so now I'm just going to show you how I dry it. Okay guys, so this is how I dry it. We take a good old handy dandy microwave. Alright. And uh, just to show you that the board is in there. Now we want to select a, you know, nothing too crazy. I was thinking, uh, like five minutes. I don't know if you guys can see that. Okay. So, five minutes. Oh, a pretty light show. Oh, yeah, some fire. Bad out. Now, this is just going to, uh, going to fix it slowly. Oh, we got a little smoke coming up the side. Oh, better close the garage door. Now, you want to make sure you do this in a well-ventilated area because you don't want all the smoke in your <laughs> So you just do it in a well-ventilated area and you know, you just slowly fix it right up. Fucking one flame of smoke show at a time. Okay, so what do we have there? can't tell. LCD stopped I reckon. Okay, but I'm gonna guess she's about medium rare. Okay, I think she's uh, probably about done. So we're just gonna open this baby up. We'll hit stop first. We'll just give that a second to cool down. Damn! Alright, so I'm going to take a shot in the dark. Oh yeah. We we most likely got the water off the board. Okay. Whew. Whew, it looks a little warm. Okay. That plug right there, you didn't need that anyway. So all that is just for the printer part. Okay. So we're going to give that uh, probably like two or three minutes to cool. It's still uh, smoking a little bit. Okay, so I'll get back to you once this thing cools. Okay, so I got the motherboard out. Now when doing this process, uh, again, you may end up losing a couple PCI slots, so nothing to be alarmed about, but if I had to tell you in advance. <laughs> Alright. Same as uh, the audio plugs, little jammed up with stuff, so you may have to do a soldering job. But as for everything else, it all looks pretty good. Um, looks like we lost a capacitor, but I'm sure it doesn't need that. Those are extra pieces. Oh, there's another piece of capacitor inside there. But like I said, and there's a battery. You don't need a battery or a computer, it's operated by fucking hydro. You know, the BIOS is still intact, so it's good to go. Alright, oh, that capacitor is a little bit bulged out. Nothing major, though. Fucking plug her in, and away we go. 
Well guys, for some reason the board still won't turn on, so I'm going to take a shot in the dark and say, you know, it's probably still got a drop or two of water. So all you do is you just take your motherboard, you stick it back in the microwave, and push start again. You know, let her finish what she was doing. Like I said, this could take five, maybe even ten minutes to, to get going. Put this on the tripod. Now you, you, you don't want to go too long though. You don't want to melt all your slots. You just want to warm it up a notch. Oh, there we go. See that fire? That that's probably a little bit of water. That's what I'm gonna guess. A little bit of water there. So. I'll just give that a bit. Got a little bit of smoke, but that's fine. It's, you know, probably just a bit of steam or something. And just take a guess in the dark. Oh, still got a little bit of fire. Must be a lot of water on there. But we'll, we'll give that a minute. You know, you, you don't... You don't want to stop this process too soon. And I think we're pouring a little bit of smoke out the side there. Hmm. I'm going to take a shot in the dark and say it's probably about done. You know, my, my whole place is filling up with smoke. So, we're going to stop right now. She looks medium rare. Okay, don't don't mind the fire. You just you just blow that out, or it might even go out on its own. I don't know. We'll blow it out. See, good as new, just like new. All right. Now, just like cooking, you you want to give it, you know, five ten minutes to cool down, and then serve. All right. Now, I forget to tell you, when you use your microwave, it gets a little dirty. Alright, just just a little bit. So you just wipe that right off like it's nothing. Nobody ever has to know. Alright, so I tried the board again and uh, it still doesn't come on, so I'm gonna take a shot in the dark and say, you know, maybe it was supposed to have all those PCI ports and, you know, a couple capacitors and whatnot, and those shouldn't be melted, so. Next time I do it, maybe I should only put it in for like 15 seconds or something, you know. Five minutes was a little long. But, on other news, I got a cool microwave. That crispy shit in it. <laughs> Anyways guys, have a good one.